welcome back to another video today I'm doing a first impression slash swatch and mini review type of video I don't know if you've all seen but on Instagram there is a new brand going all around Instagram and it's called Mode Cosmetics I first stumbled across it at Coles supermarkets where I do my weekly grocery shopping in Australia here and basically it's an amazing new brand and it's a cruelty free brand like actually accredited cruelty free because if you don't know there's a difference between non accredited and accredited in cruelty free statuses and I'm trying to slowly convert my way to cruelty free only products so I'm just putting that out there so I don't actually know if it's vegan as such like designer brands most of their products is vegan however this is cruelty free I do know that got the little rabbit there to prove it yes it's an open package um so anyway I picked these up over a couple of weeks because you know I'm a tad addicted to shopping so first off by the way when you go into Coles it says three dollars on the tag but on the receipt it came up as two dollars forty five so either way it's a bargain but currently my favorite is this press powder. Um, did I also say that this is owned by Australis? It's like a sister brand to Australis. So you know BYS, that brand. LOL is their brand. And I think that other one that's in Kmart, the $2 one, is also their brand, but I'm not 100 percent sure on that, so don't quote me on that one. But I know that LOL, lots of love that cheap $2 makeup is their brand. Um I got this in the shade Soft Ivory. The packaging is a bit meh, but what do you expect for $2.45? That's what the powder looks like. Very good quality, it lasts all day, non cakey, and I love it. I will be purchasing this again over my Australis, um, what is it, the Fresh and Flawless? You know that one that's all over the interwebs? So next to go with powder, this has been my everyday contouring, not that I'm really that good at contouring, but you know, but anyway, gorgeous colour, it's called Sunkissed, how pretty, perfect colour for us pale girls, don't you reckon, I reckon it is. So I'll be purchasing more of them and apparently they're bringing out more in their range which I'm so excited for I can tell you that much because I've seen blushes, nail polishes, eyeshadows, I want to get the creme brulee eyeshadow next so and more shades in the lipsticks. Speaking of lipsticks that was a great segue Jess. Lip liner. This one is in the shade Pink Orbit. By the way I also love how they name their shades. I hate it when companies don't name their shades. Like, how hard is it, companies? Name your friggin' shades. Who else is with me on that? Anyone? Sorry, I get a little bit over enthused about that. I do have their Mavi lip liner. I think that's in the shade Jive, but I can't find it. That's the color of that. You guys know now that I love my pink lipsticks and all that jazz. I just tried smudging it, it won't come off. That's a good sign. Alright, foundation. I picked up two. Liquid foundation and this one's an inter interesting one. It's the two-in-one foundation and concealer stick. Now I've lost the packaging and can't remember what it actually says. You know about the product, but it's in soft tan. Perfect colour for me. Um Oh, piss! No! I don't know if you just saw that! Mm. Oh, talk about crappy packaging. Alright, well that's a problem. So sad. It was good. But all at $2.45, I can just repurchase it. The actual product, however, is good. I do like it. That's 
why I prefer these packaging. A matte medium coverage foundation that regulates pigment dark shades and reduces, reduces shine. This formula moisturizes the skin providing a smooth finish. For best results, apply onto the face and neck with a sponge or brush applicator. Really, 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 really good. Surprisingly good for $2.45 because I thought the cheap foundation would be just be cheap and horrible. But no, I like it. I'd say a... Not sheer, but not quite medium as well, if that makes sense. But it's buildable. I like it. Good colour. What colour did I get? I don't know. The light one. Misplaced the little cap for it. Oh, this is in black. Do I actually have the brown one as well that I actually use to fill my eyebrows with? Who would have thought? Um, this is good. Not bad for that one. Now these are three liquid matte lipsticks that I've got. Gorgeous shades. I've got the shade Sleeping Beauty, which is a really nice nudey one. The applicator is just a typical doe foot applicator. Pigmented, long wearing, non drying as well because I hate drying matte lip creams. Oh, this one is J'adore. Really, really pink. Pretty pink, I was going to say. And this is the one that I'm wearing. You know, you knew that I had to buy this one because your girl loves this kind of pink. Yes. 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 Sorry, I get excited about these kind of pinks. How would you describe this kind of pink? Like a fuchsia pink? I don't know, I like it. It's called. Russian Skies. Why would you call that Russian Skies? I don't know. But look. So pretty. Two more lipsticks. I forgot about them. Okay, I've got this one in Amaze Balls. Now I'm going to be careful with actually opening this. Can you just tell that I've got a thing for these lipsticks? Like the pinks? How pretty is that? One is Simplicity. It actually smells nice, kind of like a light frosting smell. How pretty is that? Yes. Alright guys, they are the swatches of this new brand. Go and get it from Coles. For $2.45 there's a couple of hits and misses. Obviously the packaging is not the great, I mean that's just depressing but oh well um, but overall there's good products I love the bronzing powder I love the press powder the lipsticks are phenomenal stunning quality in lipsticks so I really like them I cannot wait to try any you know new products that they bring out especially blushes yes all right guys please thumbs up comment down below what you enjoy trying out in new products and if you like any of the shades, they're the swatches once again. Pictures are on my Instagram too, guys. So if you want to go check out them, see what the packaging's like, yada yada, go check that out. I'll link it all down below. Subscribe, thumbs up, comment, and I'll see you all in another video soon.